Hey, how you guys doing? Welcome back to another episode of Soldiers Talk the Podcast. I'm your host, Staff Sergeant McPherson, and on this show, we discuss military topics with current and prior service members. Okay, you guys, so today we're going to be talking about proposing the ARCA 15. So, uh, I know a lot of people have not proposed one before. I'm just going to show you, I'm just going to tell you how the process is supposed to go. Uh, make sure you guys stay tuned for this video. Okay, you guys, so like I was saying, we're going to be talking about proposing the ARCA 15. Uh, welcome to Podtober Day 17. This is Podtober Day 17. Uh, make sure you guys hit the like button for me. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you guys want to uh, have, if you guys have any suggestions about future episodes, you can hit me up at this email right here. Uh, so we're going to get straight into it, you guys. So proposing Article 15. So you only want to propose an Article 15 if the soldier did something really bad. You know what I mean? Uh, you shouldn't be proposing an Article 15 for just any little thing, right? So uh, unfortunately, there are NCOs out here that will give you Article 15 on your first offense. Uh they won't even give you a counseling statement first. They'll just automatically uh, propose a, uh, Article 15 for you, right? So this is how it's supposed to go. So say a soldier messed up, you think it's Article 15 worthy. Uh, you go to the first side and be like, okay, I want to do this, right? So the first side should just uh, have a sit, have sit down with you and talk about why you want to do this what led you up to want to do this uh and he basically going to form an opinion about whether it's arc 15 worthy or not and he's going to let you know do you still want to go through with it if you still want to go through with it then you go talk to the commander right so you're going to do the same thing with the commander but when you get to the commander well first are right, also you you want to have your counseling packet together so counseling packet that's why that's why I say, you guys, counseling are important. Counseling soldiers are is important, uh, and you should be maintaining the monthly counseling. So that way, uh, it's like a, you can see the progression or you can see the uh, degression. Uh, so, uh, yeah, so that's what they're going to look at. They're going to see... Is it a pattern of whatever you're proposing this arc of 15 for to see if they can go through with it? So say it's not more than likely if that soldier has been doing what you say they've been doing and it's on paper, then it shouldn't be a problem with going through with their arc of 15. But the main thing they looking at you guys is the counseling statements and making sure you're closing the counseling statements out. So if you just so if you just show up to the commander or the first star with a with, with the counseling packet and the counseling statements, the counselings are not closed out like they're supposed to. They not going to be able to help you guys. You know what I mean? They're not going to be able to, to it's not going to be, able to, it's not going to be successful because that's what legal also looks at. Legal also looks at, there are the counseling statements closed out. Uh, and like I was saying, so article 15 should be the last resort you want to go to because you, you know, unless it's just on that level to where it has to go that way. Right. So yeah, that's basically what you do. And you're going to they're going to see, you're going to sit down with them. And uh, if that counseling pay, if that counseling packet is in order is, it should be no problem on uh, granting your article 15 or actually going through it, through with the uh, process. Right. But if you're, that's the main thing, you guys, you got to have a counseling packet in order. You know, the counseling packet got to speak for you. 
You know what I mean? You can't go in there. And it can't be your word. It's got to be in black and white. So that's all I want to get it today, you guys. Uh, proposing Article 15. The main thing comes down to proposing Article 15, depending on the commander in the first art, because I have been uh, recommended for Article 15, and I didn't even know the NCO. You know, it's just blatant disrespect. And well, yeah, I I disrespected it. That's what his was his uh his side of the story was. I disrespected him, and I did, but uh he didn't i didn't even know him you know what i mean and you know he was able to re recommend me for article 15. so sometimes it comes down to counseling package you guys and sometimes it's just i guess they come down to the actual decision on what the first and our commander want to do so that's only that's 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 all i had today for you guys man uh you got any uh so if you got any uh thing on the topic let me know uh if i missed anything you guys or how things supposed to go or how it went when you proposed your first article 15 let me know you guys uh this has been another episode of soldiers talk the podcast and i'll see you guys in formation